What's going on everybody? I am here in Jasper, Alabama to revisit the grave of a fellow that we've already profiled in one of our videos. He is George Lindsay. Now, if you've been with this channel for, you know, what little bit it's been going, you know that we had one video that was titled, uh, I think it was Bear Bryant, Davy Allison, and George Lindsay, where we just kind of, you know, went and saw all three of those graves. We visited and paid our respects. Well, in that video, we just kind of stood there and we're like, yep, there he is. We didn't really do a lot of talking. We didn't describe anything about his life and how we got to where he's at and why he's here or anything. So I thought, what better way to come back and let's do it right. Let's pay our respects to the great George Lindsay. And if that's something you're into, then let's go find his grave and we'll pay our respects and while we're looking for it I'll say a little bit about him. Also before we get going there is one grave and I think I see where it's at that I want to go visit and it's to do with another Hollywood celebrity it's more or less the you know you'll see when we get there but as we're going you know I don't know what it is about the wind how when I have to do this, the wind has to blow, so if it's kind of getting in there with the audio, I apologize, but I'm going to do the best that I can, and we're going to get through this. It's, uh, the older people see a young guy walking through a cemetery with a camera, and they think something's going on, so they have to, they're curious, they don't know. Even younger people, they don't really understand some people just don't get it you know but so what I was saying if this is your first time here well let me get the ad out of the way welcome the channel has grown over the past month month and a half I mean we have gained 800 subscribers in that amount of time and it's all thanks to you you people are digging the content that I'm putting out there and you're subscribing and doing all the things that I'm asking and I cannot appreciate you enough and thank you enough for all the things that you've done i mean it, it it is amazing what has happened and if you haven't subscribed let's get this out of the way i know if you haven't please consider hitting that button and liking it sharing it doing all the things with people that you uh you know somebody that might be interested in it somewhere else so with that all that bs out of the way Let's go to this other place I want to film real quick before we get to Mr. Lindsay, shall we? Okay, so what you see here that's upside down is the graves of all the bank heads. The bank heads are originally from Jasper, Alabama, and if you notice, his wife is named Tallulah. And if that name rings a bell, that's because he had a daughter named Tallulah Bankhead too. So Tallulah Bankhead is originally from Jasper, Alabama. Now she's not buried here. She is interred somewhere in New York, I believe. But Mr. Bankhead and all his sons were either senators, representatives, or stuff like that. They were very important people in the community, in the state, in the government. So I wanted to come over here and see this first before we get to Mr. Lindsay. So yeah, this is famous movie star Tallulah. This is her parents and brothers and sisters, I think, maybe. So yeah, let's get back to Mr. Lindsay, shall we? It's a beautiful graveyard. Lots of new, older headpieces, nice headpieces. where Mr. Lindsay's at is towards the the newer side but as you go back in that direction that's the older cemetery that's the original a long time ago this was on the outskirts of town now it's it's kind of right in the middle of town thanks to the highway that comes through but let's talk a little bit about Mr. Lindsay shall we 
George Lindsay was born in Fairfield, Alabama to George Ross Lindsay, a butcher, and his wife, Alice. He was raised by his grandparents here in the small town of Jasper, Alabama, which isn't such a small town anymore. He graduated from Walker County High School in 1946. He attended Kemper Military School in Missouri and Florence State Teachers College, now the University of North Alabama, go Lions, where he majored in physical education and biology. He was quarterback on the football team there. Never knew that. And acted in college plays and, re and received his bachelor's of science in 1952. In 1964, Lindsay was cast as the slow-witted but kindly Goober Beasley on the Andy Griffith Show. His character was later renamed Goober Powell to tie him to his cousin Gomer Powell. Which, if you know about Gomer Powell, that's Jim Neighbors, and he's from Alabama also. Not buried here. His ashes have been scattered across Hawaii somewhere. Goober's antics frequently included his exaggerated Goober dance and his comedy bad Cary Grant impressions. During an interview segment of TV Land's 40th anniversary, Star Trek's marathon in 2006, Leonard Nimoy stated that Gene Roddenberry, his first choice to play Spock, was George Lindsay. Could you imagine George Lindsay being Spock? The claim Lindsay was offered the role is given more credibility when Lindsay's close friend, Ernest Borgnine, wrote in his autobiography, My Hand to God, he turned down the part of Spock on Star Trek, the role that made Nimoy famous. Lindsay portrayed Goober for the third and last time on the syndicated country music variety show, Hee Haw. God, Hee Haw was great. Playing a more rustic version of the character, he appeared on that show from 1972 to 1992. Lindsay died on May 6th in 2012 in Nashville from heart failure. He was 83 years old. And here we go. The grave of George Lindsay. I'm glad I made you laugh. Such a simple, not complicated, just like all the others we go to. This one's in its own tomb of sort where normally it's just a headpiece. I would imagine this is the the family lot because it's all it has Smiths all around it, so that's probably his grandparents lot. And that's it. So I tell you what, if let me get off these graves, I don't want to be stepping on nobody like that. If that's that's uh that's something neat that we finally got to, you know, pay our respects. To a Hollywood icon that I, well at least I think he is anyway he made a lot of people laugh and in times like these it wouldn't be it'd be nice if we had Mr. Lindsay back to make people laugh again seems like we don't like to do a lot of laughing these days but uh, if you've made it this far thank you so much I uh, hope that you enjoyed the video if you did subscribe like share do all the things we're growing as a channel and i have to say all that to try to get us to that thousand subscriber mark once we can get there and we can get monetized then you know maybe things will change and we can go to bigger and better places not that mr Lindsay's not a bigger and better place but we could travel outside the southeast a little bit maybe so thank you for watching and you never know what you're going to find on the back roads